James Kaufman, World News Report Today. Today is April 14th, 2022, 1 p.m. Central here in the USA. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world, folks. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Well, ladies and gentlemen, they actually nailed it. We're in a geomagnetic storm. We have been for at least, well, at least the last three hours, probably the last 12 hours, based on what we're looking at here. And, uh, well, I'm excited that they actually put it together properly. Let's take a look at some data. Heading over to Discover, we see that we have been in a space weather event. Uh, and we have, well, elevated plasma early on in the day just after zero hundred UTC time uh, actually goes up to about 15 centimeters cubed it drops off and then it slowly elevates back up we're currently you know just about where we were I think we've broken below the 10 centimeters cubed now Along with that, guys, we had the solar winds pick up from 445 to almost, well, 560, 570 kilometers per second. Uh, temperatures have only increased during that solar wind uh, pickup, and they're back to normal. So we're in a heavy solar storm right now although plasma is waning and solar storms are starting to calm down as well so we're gonna have to give a thumbs up to NOAA and NASA and a thumbs down to the ESA for pushing this impact off till tomorrow ladies and gentlemen God bless you and yours uh, hopefully everyone's feeling okay we just got hit again by a KP6, as you can see here, all part of the party. And we are still in the situation. It's going to be more solar uh, wind driven because, again, the plasma has dropped off. God bless you and yours. Uh, hopefully everything's fine with you. Please share, please subscribe, and always remember that anything's possible in Bizarre World.